Hey guys, it's Tim Ferdauer here, and today I'm super excited to show you a brand new video software that allows you to create videos from a single keyword. It comes with video IDs, it writes the scripts for you, it creates the videos for you. Uh, you can create videos from a single URL, you can create videos from templates like you're seeing right here in the background. Uh, I've worked closely with the developer asking for some improvements, which he also implemented, which you definitely will like. Uh, I'm going to show you everything on the inside. But before I do so, I want to mention that there is a link in the description of this video. It will redirect you to my website where you can find more information about this product, Restory. Uh, also the pricing and the funnel details. So here you can see the front end. It actually starts for $37. I need to change this. It comes with some upsells. So make sure you check out what's in the upsells and also a bundle deal, uh, which basically means that you're going to get all the, uh, the funnel and the upsells um, for a discounted price. Now, if you pick this up through my link, you're also going to get all these extra free software bonuses. Uh, simply click on one one of these buttons, purchase it, and I will be sending it to your purchase email address. All right, let's dive into this and let me show you how Restory works. Now, like I said, you can create videos and basically you're going to create reels, video reels with Restory. So you could use these reels on Instagram, on Facebook, on YouTube, short videos. And these videos are really professional. Um, impressed by the quality of this product about the simplicity also because to create videos is super simple so what i'm going to do is first i'm going to show you how to work with templates then i'm going to show you how to create videos from a single keyword uh, and then i'm going to show you how to do that from a url so right now i'm in the template section and these are all beautiful templates when you click on the template you can see all the slides all the videos uh, that you can edit and use to your own needs. Now, let's say you create uh, something for a business owner, you, 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 you sell this to other businesses, you can use these templates and modify them to their business needs. So if you make videos for a pizza company, voila, you already got a video ready here, you replace this with their workers, etc. It's super simple. As you can see, it looks very professional. All these templates look very, very professional. So uh, you simply pick one of these templates and you modify them. So let's say we want to create a fitness video. We're going to use this template with these, uh, yeah, with these scenes to to name it. So you simply click on use this template, and now it will uh, open the editor for you. And creating videos is so simple. Uh, look at this. These are all the videos that you're going to create. So these are videos from two, three, four, five seconds each. And you can also connect them all together. That's one of the, the things that I said, hey, you need to implement this. And he has done that. I'm going to show you how that works as well. But look at this, this looks professional. Now, the only thing that you need to do and can do is you change these elements inside. So Let's say you don't like this Apple Watch and you want to personalize this. You can upload your own videos, but you can also use uh, their built-in library here of images, videos, GIF files, stickers. So let's say we want to add a video background in here. We are simply going to search for fitness and then it comes up with all these videos that you're free to use. So let's say uh, you want to use one of these videos. Let's see which one is a nice one here that we can use. Uh, I think this is a cool one. So when you click on the plus button, you can insert this video as a video, but you can also add this the back as a background. Now look what happens. Now when we play this first video, look what happens. This is a very cool video, right? And it was super easy to create. You simply modify each part. You can change the colors if you like to change another color in here. Uh, also for the text, it comes with a bunch of fonts. Look at this. All these fonts are available and you simply go over each slide. You click on an image and you replace it with your own video. So if you'd like to add another video here, simply take this one, add as a background. Look at this. And not only that, you can also add your own elements. So let's say you want to add shapes and stickers. That's super easy to do. I always like these shapes and it's super easy. If you want to have this, for example, you have text there and you'd like to add this below the text, you can simply say send backwards and now the text is on top of it. Now let's say we want to have this another color 
uh, we want to have this yellow just like the rest of this video uh, you can change this you see that and then we simply change the text to black in here and it's super easy and also if you like to do you can add animation to each part here so you can drop this here look at this or maybe you want to fade this in or you want to pulse this this is a cool one look at this and then you can also when you click on this again you can set the pulse duration in here or the scale or uh the pulses you can say i want to have for example i want to have five pulses in here so look at this one two and then it keeps pulsing so for each slide you can add your own elements so let's say you don't want to have this in the phone you simply delete it this is a beautiful phone here you want to add your own image you simply go to images you do fitness in here let's say we want to add this one we're going to add this as an image simply crop this one and look what i'm going to do right now because what it also comes with here is layers when i say here right button i can send this to the back do you see that and now I can send this yellow to the back here. And now I've added my own image inside of this phone. You could do way more. You could select multiple elements in here. And you can say, I want to group elements and then, uh, or select one with a shift. And you can say, I want to group layers. And then when you move things, it will be moving like a group. Now, if you want to undo what you have done, you simply click on the undo buttons. And boom your slide is there again so it's super easy to go over all these slides as you can see and it's super easy to simply replace all the elements if you want to do something like this insert it as a background boom and simply move this and make it a little bit wider like you're seeing right here and boom so once you're done uh you can click on save now before i do so i want to show the layers part so each slide comes with a bunch of layers as you can see even sub layers you can move these layers around you can delete these layers it's very professional you can even add extra slides you can duplicate slides so if you want to have a duplicate of this slide because you want to show multiple phones you can duplicate this you can remove this and once you're done you can simply click on save here and you can give your uh, story a name so i'm going to call this fitness and now when we click on publish we have the option to publish this story now for each video here you can say i want to have this four seconds and the second second video i want to have this five seconds and the next one i want to have three seconds and i want to have this three seconds i want to have this one four seconds i want to have this five seconds for example and this one four seconds and this one three seconds do you see what i'm doing for each slide i i'm telling um restory how long these slides need to be so this one four seconds and then if you like you can add music as well now personally i don't like to add the music in here uh, you can do that if you want to have each slide with music you can add the music in here uh, personally i don't like to do this so when i click on render it's going to render this video for us now this only takes a few minutes this doesn't take a long time within a few minutes all your videos all these videos that you're seeing right here will be rendered for you and you can upload them all separately to your instagram stories to your facebook stories to your uh youtube shorts uh, but what i like to do is to create one video of this project now we can do that right now you can see it pending so i'll be back once this uh pending has been done So right now it took a few minutes, it's ready for download. So when I click on download here, you can see each specific slide. So when I click on download, you can see this is one video that we created. And I can simply download this here, I can click on download and download and upload this to my social media channels. Now, for each separate video, if you like to have one long video of all these videos so that you can use this for a YouTube short, for example, or maybe you want to upload this as one video, there's an option to merge your videos here. It's called Video Merger. And here you will be able to merge your video. So when you select your video, you can see here is the video at the right side. And when I select all these videos, so from here, it's going to render all the thumbnails. I can select, I want to have all these... Um, these videos to be connected you see that 
and all of your projects will be in here. So if you've created multiple projects, you can also add those projects. Let's say I've also created pizza videos. I want to add that those as well. I can add those as well. But in this case, we're not going to do that. And as you can see, all the slides have been added here at the bottom. Now, Another thing that you're going to do here is upload your music. So you can upload this from your computer here, and now you can listen to it. So when I click on play, this is how it will sound and look like. So you can change the source volume. So if the source has also audio in it, you can set the source to higher volume or lower volume or the music volume. You can change that in here as well. And once you're satisfied, you simply click on combine videos. You're going to give this a name, fitness uh, merged. You're going to click next. And right now it's a combined video it's going to render this as a combined video and this was one of the features that i said you definitely need to implement this he did it and i think it's wonderful because right now with this option you'll you'll be able to create such beautiful videos now i'll be back once this has been rendered now this took about one minute to render this video so i'm going to click on download and here you can see the video so when i click on download we're gonna watch what we just created. So that looks, oh, that looks pretty cool, right? And super easy to create. You can add your own videos, your own images inside of a template and it works really quickly. Now the next thing that you can do is you can create videos from AI here. So you simply have to type your keyword. Let's say we're gonna do fitness again to create a fitness video. Then when we click next, the AI is going to suggest videos for us that we can create. Look at this. At home workouts for busy people, developing healthy eating habits, getting motivated to work out, stretching improved flexibility, 10 minute cardio workout. Now this is a cool one. Let's do this one. Or, um, yeah, let's take the 10 minutes. So I'm going to select this one and now it's going to create the script for us. So we, we, came up with this ID and now it's going to create these videos. Start off with a 10 minute cardio workout, get your heart rate up and your blood pumped with a quick routine. Jumping jacks, mountain climbers and burpees are great exercise to include. Set a timer and challenge yourself, blah, blah, blah. So when I click go to storyboard, I can choose the template that I would like to use for this. So let's say I like this template. I simply select this template and now it's going to create the video for us. It's going to add the text, the scenes inside of the video for us. And it's super easy. Now, one thing that I noticed that I'm not impressed by is that the, the images that it comes with. So right now you can see this when I double click this, uh, you can see this is a tree. So it didn't do a very good job on finding fitness videos. This is a, co a good one. Uh, this is not, I mean, this is chess, you know. So what you can do again, and this is, is another one. So not the best one. So what we want to do is we want to change this, right? So we go to images, we do fitness, and we can change this real quickly. But the script has been done for us, right? So what we do simply is we're going to click plus, insert video image. And what I showed you before, simply hover over it and look at this. Now it's, oh, let me redo that. Yeah, there it is. When I double click this, I can move this to the top and look at this, boom, this is now on this slide. Let's go to the next slide. I wanna have a video as a background. So we're gonna have fitness again. Let's take um, the one that we did before. That was a cool one, I think. I think it was here, yes. Let's add this as a background and then let's 
move this to the bottom and let's move this here and boom the second slide has been done now when we play this video it looks like this we go to the next slide here the third slide so we're going to move this to the bottom here and i think this is a good one we go to the next slide so we're going to change this chess one we're going to change this for another video we're going to use this one insert video we're going to drag this to the corner and boom there it is we go to the next slide so do you see how easy it is to create a video from a script and of course you need to move some elements it's not everything is done for you but within literally three minutes i can have my video done by simply select this add this as a background now we have this as a background i can even move this like this and if i like this i'm gonna play this video and this is a workout we go to the next slide and that's how easy it is you simply click on save and your video has been saved you can publish this just like i showed you before i'm going to say each slide needs to be so and so many seconds and that's it very cool right so the next option to create a project here is from a url now basically i don't like this feature too much but what you can do is you can take a url so for example how to teach your dog to walk beside you in seven simple steps what i'm going to do is i'm going to copy this url I'm gonna paste that in here. I'm gonna click on next. And what will happen is that Restory will take all of the text. It fetched the whole website here, all the content on the website. Now, when you click on auto summarize, let's see what it comes up with right now. So it's going to auto summarize what it finds on this website. And it depends on what kind of blog you wanna create a video for. But you simply add your blog in here it's going to summarize this and it comes up here with the ID. So these are the scenes right now here. First one, this is live chat. The, se the second is walking your dog is one of the most essential responsibilities as a dog owner. So the script is, you know, it's going to come with, with good IDs, but in my opinion, this is way too much text for a single slide. So this can be improved and I know they're still working on improving this application, but if you like to use this, you simply uh, remove some elements. You can uh, also remove text or edit and you click on go to storyboard. You simply select the template and it will create the templates for you. Uh, but like I said, this is not the the best function uh, creating a video from a blog, as you can see here, because you're you're definitely missing content. It, it can be done, as you can see here, uh, but it's a lot of text for a single slide, and then the rest works exactly the same. So, if you want to merge again, you go to Video Merger here at the left side. You simply choose the videos that you like to merge. If you have multiple projects here, combine videos, add your audio, and voila you're done and that's basically what restory is all about very cool editor super easy to use for anyone and if you're interested again make sure to check out the link in the description of this video uh, also please hit a thumbs up if this video was useful and uh, consider subscribing to my youtube channel if you haven't done yet i do a lot of product reviews so uh, hit that notification bell if you would like to stay updated and uh, thank you so much for watching i hope to see you in my next video talk soon cheers